close to the eye of the storm. Be ready for a fight. Yeah, come on. This ain't our first rodeo with a prize. Rampaging primals before. We'll just have to do it again. Right. We'll chip away at its defenses until Lyria is able to absorb its power. Yeah. We'll just have to hold them off until Lyria can punch Be on your toes. Lyria can. We're going to save you. Let's back off. Watch its behavior for now. All these rough winds. Kinda reminds you of Tiamat, doesn't it? Tiamat's anger was always motherly somehow. Felikin's gale seemed to shriek with hate. No question. My god. Now it's on! What do you think? Ready if you want more. Don't. Fighting on our side this time. Focus. Hurricane's power is starting to swell. Hold up. Did the demon pony just transform? It is a primal beast, after all. Were you expecting something different? You can tell primal beasts were weapons created by Astros. Their powers are capable of untold destruction. But after the war, they abandoned us here in the Skyrim. Some took to the land. Some were deified. Still others found a home alongside Skydwell and helped advance great civilizations. A Kyrakin, primal of vitality. It blessed him filled with its power. How callous it is to twist this creative soul into an instrument of destruction. Payback's on its way. Darn right. Just don't get sloppy. But this thing means business. Jordan, I promise we'll save you. Its magic reserves are crazy. It keeps flinging attack after attack. Something about Furikin's power feels unnatural. Huh? What do you mean? I'm not sure, but something isn't right. Like, 
American! Please don't! Heads up! Don't get caught flat-footed! You need treatment! I'm right behind you. Solid wrong! What do you Captain! Do? Way ahead of you! Tempest play! Ah! Catalina! I'll protect you! Go for it! Into the ice area! Bring it! Ascension! I'll take it from here! see that ship? Ruby red for the hull? Sticks out like a sore thumb, don't it? Beast is being absorbed. But it doesn't. It's not Lyria's doing. This can't be. Hey. Lyria! What's wrong? It wasn't me. I didn't. I couldn't stop it. <laughs> No friends of ours, I'd wager. Hmm. Now, they look like a fun bunch to tangle with. Do not deviate from the mission. We are simply here for a meet and greet. And you are? We've been waiting for you, Shaman of Salvation. Now, would you be so kind as to join us? <laughs> If you value your life, you'll leave us alone. Oh, fancy a challenge, huh? Fine, have it your way. I'll end this in 90 seconds. Suffer! 
need to run! <laughs> I expected more bite. What do you think? <laughs> I'll crush you! You're tough for a normal warrior. It's inhuman what he can do. A bloom for any season. Can't keep up. Winter crush you. Not quite. bloom. Great time's up. No falling under my watch. Welcome to my garden. Come. Enough of you. Fool. <laughs> what do you think? Uh, one one. Here you go. Let's go. Play too hard now. Playtime's over. <laughs> what do you think? <laughs> Not quite. Not for any season. <laughs> Beautiful. <Here it> comes. <laughs> Goodbye. <laughs> it can't be. One left. Uh, he's a freak. <laughs> How do you even get that Take strong? <laughs> So we finally meet. Huh? Oh, Shaman of Salvation, long have we waited for this day. What? Shaman? Me? How uncanny. So much in common with the blue butterfly and Seed Hollow's elegy. Oh, my apologies. You must be bewildered by this uh, disrespectful I, treatment. I... Who the heck are you? And what do you want from us? Oh. How rude of me. You may call me Lilith. They, the pilgrims of Avia. I, their shepherd. And I will not rest. Not until we open the path to Utopia. Esther Lucia. Utopia? Wait, you just said Esther Lucia, but that's the same place we're headed. Ah, truly? Our goals eclipse one another. Then I needn't prattle on. This meeting has proven quite serendipitous. I promise to take care of everything. Now, dear Shaman, prepare yourself for glory, for a grand pilgrimage awaits us. We shall pave a new path to Estelucia. I don't think so! You don't get to make the rules on my watch! You fuckface! It... Come, 
Let us return. Ma'am! Just stand up! There we go! I won't go with you! Get the flames! My name is... You are unworthy. beside herself. We can't afford to stop. We have to save Lyria. Whoa, try to cool down there, Cat. But I promised her. I promised her I would show her the outside world, no matter the danger. What if I can't protect her? What if I can't get her back? I refuse to break my vow. We know how you feel. But we can't jump the gun here, not without knowing more. Yeah, that guy was tough. We need a plan. Otherwise, he'll just mop the floor with us again. No matter. We can't stop until we have Lyria back. Right. We're coming, Lyria. Oh, Catalina. <gasps> Captain! Glad you're back on your feet. You scared the hell out of us. I'm sorry, Captain. I wasn't strong enough to protect Lyria. Good news, folks! I got a lead on those ruffians who ambushed you! Really? Where did they take her? Tell me right now or else. Jeepers! Calm down, Catalina. Is that any way to say thanks for the help? Uh, of course. Sorry. It's quite all right. I know exactly how you feel, Catalina. With all you did for us, it's only fair that I do my part to help you. Besides, looking into the Church of Avia was fairly simple. church. They did call themselves pilgrims. Oh! How 
are you feeling, Captain? Never mind me. Where'd Avia go? Yes, well, uh, about that. It seems like they're taking Lyria to Latanya Island. Where's that? Fret not. I'll show you the way myself. Whoa, slow down, champ. First of all, we're Skyfarers. We can't be babysitting. Point made. I see we've severely underestimated you, Roland. <laughs> Look, the Church of Avia grows bolder by the day. They used force in Tempil and abducted Lyria, an innocent traveler. I cannot sit idly by and allow such deeds to go unpunished. I'm quite capable of handling myself in a fight, and will do my best to aid you. If I may? Every Skydom's got a bad bunch. If you're offering to help us with them, I won't say no. Hmm. Now, uh, about your ship. You know, the really big blue one? The Grand Cipher. Yes, that's it. The repairs on the Grand Cipher will soon be completed. I did a little work on it myself, and just wait until you see what I... installed. You what? No! Oh, silly me! I must have been rambling about something else. Moving right along. I took the liberty of procuring a new weapon and some armor for you, Captain. Your current gear has certainly seen better days, after all. <laughs> Sweet! That's real nice of ya! I hate to imagine Folka's fate if your crew hadn't shown up when it did. These small tokens of appreciation are hardly enough to convey our gratitude. <laughs> well, thanks all the same, Fix-It Dude. It's Roland. We're grateful for all you've done, Roland. All right, let's get a move on. Sure. Let me pack my things and I'll meet you by the dock. See you soon. Lilith, enough is enough. Catalina, Lyria's kidnapping has hit her extra hard. <sighs> we'll save her, no matter what. Of course. I don't care how strong they are. I'm not... We're not giving up. Look, Lyria's grown so much since she met you. Almost every night, she would come and tell me about her day, and all the new things she experienced with you and the crew. And each time, I was more and more glad we all found ourselves on this journey together. I won't let it end here. 
I promised Lyria that we'd see the world. That we'd see the end of the skies. So I swear, we'll get her back. Together, as a crew. Lyria, don't give up. I hope Eugen's not beating himself up too much. Hey, Captain. Can you ever forgive me? For what? Sorry, but I gotta apologize. See, I had a bad feeling the second I saw that red ship. When you've been through as much as I have, you develop a sixth sense for danger. But I still ignored the warning bells. Damn it all! So much for calling myself a guardian. Can't protect a damn thing. Well, I ain't giving up on Lyria. I'm bringing her home, and nothing's gonna stop me. Oh, they'll pay. I'll show them what an old vet can do. Tell me, Captain, how are you feeling today? Huh, I'm pretty good, actually. Ah, I see. I like that confidence. Thankfully, it looks like you've healed up just fine. But we can't wait around any longer. Our princess awaits her rescue. It's going to work out. Excuse me. <laughs> Easier than eating apples. Got an order? What should I strengthen? Your weapons won't betray you. Wow. Despite it all, Eo seems determined. Hey, Captain. Say, you remember the promise I made with Lyria? We were gonna ask Rosetta to teach us how to put on makeup. I wonder if Lyria's crying right now. It must be scary being alone. <sighs> I can't stand it! We have to save her! Lyria... Pardon me. I heard what happened with Lyria. I'm not much use in a fight myself, but maybe I can help in my own small way. Please, take this. <laughs>
Did you miss us, Captain? Rackham looks ready to take off the second we say go. You don't think they're gonna do anything to her, do you, Captain? Either way, we have to save her. Damn straight. She's the ray of sunshine on our crew. Good thing we know where that red ship is going. Grand Cypher will hunt it down in no time. But once we catch them, those punks are gonna pay for what they did. They can run, but they can't fly from the Grand Cypher. Not while I'm Helmsman. Uh, we promised to meet up with Fix-It Dude. Let's head for the dock. the need now. Oh, 
Just done buying incredible merchandise. Daddy's ain't got nothing on you. Come to view the request. As you're ready, let's head for the docks. Lyria needs our help. 